Hey guys, welcome back. This is Rez and today we want to talk about the difference between DP and SP. What the hell are they and what are they for? So DP stands for density independent pixels and I'm always going to forget that. So I'm most likely going to say density pixels or DP or something in between. And SP stands for scalable pixels, okay? And we're going to come back to the names no we don't really care about the names okay just remember that there's DP and there's SP and S is for scalable and that really matters and while density independent pixel basically means that it will always have that specific amount of units okay so it's like an absolute amount all the time and I created an example here for you guys to kind of explain the difference and show you what it means and what it's for right so staying with the three boxes, the only difference is I made the text sizes 24 SP, 24 DP, and 24 SP. Okay, so three boxes, all pretty much the same number, except some are SP for scalable pixels, and some are DP for density pixels. Now, if we run our app, I'm going to show you where exactly this comes in. So I run it, and you got this thing. Now, if you notice already, Roar kind of looks a bit smaller. Meow looks the, the same size as our window shown in our design. And the other one's off the screen because I really chose a small emulator. I'm having uh, Macs aren't that great for running uh, big <laughs> emulators. Anyway, so Density Pixel says, hey, it's always going to take the same amount of space that I request. Now, um, scalable pixel says depending on the user so depending on my device if I go on settings and I go on font right search for font font sizes depending on the user's preference or choice the text is gonna be different and this is great because sometimes the user requires a bigger text for um, I don't know because they're blind or they can't see well etc so depending on the user's choice, you could make some part of the text which is dependent on the user to read it or it's not like a title or not something specific uh, to be the size he wants, okay? So um, to make it easier for him. So if we go back and we go on our app, now that we have it at large, we go back on this, you'll notice that Roar takes more space than Meow. Meow stays steady. And again, Meow is 24 dp density independent pixel while this roar is 24 scalable pixels okay so depending on the user it would change and this is great and this is practically the difference between sp and dp all right guys good luck leave a comment if you have any questions let me know and if you like please subscribe keep me updated cheers guys